Baruch Haba Baruch Haba by the grace of God, Brooklyn, New York, greetings and blessings. In response to your notification that your wedding date has been set, I wish to convey my blessing of Mazel Tov, Mazel Tov. May the wedding take place in a good and auspicious time, and may you build a Jewish home on an everlasting edifice on the foundation of Torah and Mitzvahs, as they are illuminated by the luminary within Torah, namely the teaching of Hasidus with the blessing of Mazel Tov, Mazel Tov and the Rebbe's signature. Our tradition informs us that the departed grandparents of both the Chassan and the Kala, going back three generations, are present, participating, celebrating, rejoicing, and blessing the Chassan and Kala today. And we have no doubt that witnessing the commitment of their grandchildren in building a home predicated on the values that they lived, breathed, and cherished. It gives them an enormous amount of nachas, an enormous amount of pleasure. The Talmud relates that the souls of the Chassan and Kala initially existed as one, as one whole soul. And when they descended down here into the world, they were separated, however, only temporarily. And to, today, under the Chuppah, the souls are reunited, fused together once again to become whole.